If you ever have trouble getting your neckline to be nice and flat when it has a facing and the facing not slipping to the right side of the garment, let me show you a trick. So now that you have all your clips, make sure you iron this before you do your understitch. So when you do the ironing, I want you to iron it as if it's going to be in its finished position. That way, all of these little clipped edges can splay out. So when I do the ironing, I do it in two steps. The first one is I iron this seam nice and flat. It doesn't matter which way you press this seam allowance right here. Just make sure you iron this very flat. And then next, I put the facing to the inside of the neck and then I give it a good press. And look, I can see a tiny bit of my outer shirt. So I know the facing's not gonna creep to the right side. And so now we're gonna do the understitch. Press the seam allowance towards the facing. Make sure all your little clipped edges stay towards the facing. And try and keep your facing as flat as possible like this, because that way those little cut edges will splay open. And you see all those little edges are all splayed out just the way they need to be. It's gonna lay nice and flat. 